But, you know, what's the point beyond that? They're fun to collect, they let you track your accomplishments, but when you get achievements, they also unlock components for your banner. So your banner is sort of a visual representation of what you've done in the game, of all your accomplishments. The more you achieve, the more components for your banner you unlock. For example, in PvP, you might get open, you know, might open some crests. Um, just playing through the game normally and getting achievements by quantity will extend this pennant so it gets more stuff on it as you play. Uh, other achievements can change the cloth, the sigil, the accents. And then, of course, if you play a lot of hardcore, the base of your banner will get bigger. And after a while, it can all add up to something pretty cool. So now, these banners are not just pretty, although they are pretty. Uh, they also allow you, in co-op, to teleport directly to your friends. So if they're out running around, you don't know where they are, you went back to town to craft something or buy from a vendor, you can just click on their banner and then teleport directly to them. So that's pretty useful. Plus, that's a good way of ensuring that people see your cool banner.